I really do feel comfortable here, especially this show, because I saw a lot of fat people come in. So thank you, fat people, for coming out. Because that's what fat people do. Fat people look at other fat people, and we judge each other, all right? I'm serious. I was walking in. I saw this one fat guy. I was like, oh, my God. Hey, Rob, I'm not that fat, right? Jesus Christ. <laughs> I was on a flight going from Charlotte, North Carolina to Augusta, Georgia. It's about a 45-minute flight. If you've ever been on a flight that takes less than an hour, you know the airline. They put you on the oldest plane that they had. Like, I got on this plane. This plane was so old, it had propellers on it, OK? <laughs> we get inside the plane. There's only two rows of seats. There's one on the right, and there's one on the left. Now, I fly over 100,000 miles a year. I can sit wherever I want. I sat in the first seat in the front. It was just us and the pilot. And the pilot was so old, he had leather goggles and a scarf, OK? <laughs> and we didn't even take off yet, and his scarf was blowing. <laughs> so the pilot comes out of the cockpit. He goes, all right, listen up. <laughs> I did the math. We're a little too heavy in the front, so. <laughs> we need some people from the front of the plane to go to the back of the plane. And then he saw me, and he was like... <laughs> you just gotta be comfortable with who you are, that's it. I'm okay with being a big guy. As a matter of fact, I'm thinking about getting my belly button pierced. I'm not sure yet. <laughs> just haven't found somebody to make a platinum hula hoop. That's my only issue, all right? <laughs> this is how comfortable I am being a bigger person. I play pranks on skinny people. I think it's funny. This is what I like to do. Usually when I get on a plane, I like to be the last person on the airplane. I like to get on the plane last and call out the C numbers like it's bingo to see what their reactions would be. Because they get really excited because the middle seat is empty, the door's about to close. They're making announcements. One dude's looking down the aisle, high-fiving the guy at the window. Like, dude, I think we're good on this flight. Then all of a sudden, I walk in. <laughs> and they're like, oh, my God. <laughs> I'm a fat terrorist. I don't care. <laughs> There's certain things you shouldn't do when you're a bigger person, okay? And if you're skinny getting fat, you might want to write this down. Uh, don't buy the Xbox Kinect. I don't know if you guys know what this is. It's just a video game with a camera on it. And instead of controlling it with a controller, you control it with your body. It's a great game. But when you buy it, the way you got to set it up is you got to take a picture of your whole body. I didn't know this. I bought the system for the first time in my life. I had it set up on the other side of the room. And the system was like, please step back. <laughs> Processing. Player one, please step back. Processing. Player two, please step out. Please step, I'm in the backyard, I can't play from here. All right, thank you guys so much. My name is Cisco.